Uh, are sweet tarts the ones, the little, the little skinny ones, right? The little skinny little tart ones that are like little discs. Yes, and, and they have one, two, three, shot. <laughs> I love that. Everyone listens to you but me. What's up, guys? It's me, Noah Galutin, here with my trusty producer T, which means that she really seems thirsty for bad alcohol. Yes. You want to drink some? I'm starting to get the shakes. Let's do this. What are we drinking, T? Today we've got Three Olives Tarts Vodka. Because of copyright issues, they call it Tarts with a Z, but I think it's meant to taste like sweet tarts, you know, the popular Halloween candy. So in honor of Halloween coming up, we've got our orange cups and we got our candy flavored vodka. Yeah, good job. Yeah, well, I try to be festive. But I do actually remember liking sweet tarts when I was a kid, and whenever I was trick-or-treating, that was one of the first things I'd reach for when I had my little haul. That's so, funny, when I was a kid, I liked vodka. Yeah. Well, you need parenting. I've got an idea. What if I pour this into a glass and then you drink it? I thought you were going to suggest we butt chug it, but that sounds like a better idea. Swirl it to let it aerate, mm -hmm. you know. That's what you do with sweet tart flavored vodka. You gotta let fine, it breathe. Fine, fine liquor. That tastes like sweet tarts vodka. I wow. mean, they nailed it. Really gets you here, and it gets you right here quite tart on the finish, uh, which is actually kind of nice. It's a little bit more complex than the typical Three Olives vodkas we're drinking on this show. It actually has a flavor progression, and it isn't just from like bad to suicidal. It's like way too sweet, oh, kind of tart. That's different. I don't know, maybe I've just uh, really descended into deep depression and alcoholism, but I don't mind this. I'll drink it. What have we done to you? I don't know, I think I've just lost my will to live and respect what I actually put in my body anymore. So of course, the cocktail of the day is the zippity do because they always have to have f***ing stupid names. Mm -hmm. So this is gonna be equal parts Tarts Vodka mm -hmm. with club soda and lemon lime flavored soda. Right, all right, let's do this. Uh, it just kinda tastes like a vodka Sprite now. I think all that did was uh, eliminate the uh, elegance and specificity that the Tarts Vodka had while neat. What do you prefer? I'd rather have it neat. All right. You've had your drink. As much as I don't want to share this, we probably should in a little segment we like to call Roofie the Office. Yes! Feed the Office. Oh, fine. <laughs> Are you a fan of Sweet Tarts the Candy? I am a huge fan of Sweet Tarts the Candy. Yeah, these three olives guys, you know, are they, they either they should be making booze or they should just be lining people up against the wall and shooting them because it has ultimately has the same effect. They're frequent perpetrators on Why Would You Drink That? Ooh, it smells like cough syrup. Actually, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. That's terrible. It's cough syrup if you melted Sweet Tarts in it. That is something. Like the moment it hits your lips, it's just like medicine. It's actually not too sweet. It's not because of the tarts. Because of the tarts. I love sweet tarts of candy. This has something in it that's like immediately your mouth is like, nope. Every sip that I take have so far has been different tastes. The kids, I think, would go for the, the kids would go, sweet ones. Oh, the kids will go for anything. This is They're more stupid. for like your your tweens. This is mm. a, yes. This is the twilight of this drinks. Is for the discerning tweens. Right. I would say of the three olives vodkas that we've had, this is the least. One of the best. This is one of the best. Well, now as try we, the zippity do, and this might change your mind. Zippity do da. Is that, is that have, I can't say you that. You don't have the rights for that. Boop. Can you imagine going into a bar and? Give me a zippity doo! I love the name of this drink. That makes one of us. Zippity doo! It's a stupid name. I agree. Shouldn't it have Mountain Dew or something in it? Well, it's if not it's zippity, zippity D E W. Um, what's the cocktail called again? Zippity doo. Da? Nope. No. I feel like Bill Cosby when I said. If, if I'm I gonna exciting... drink me a zippity doo. That is a terrible. Yeah, movie. <laughs> Brain freeze. Too cold. Too cold. Your teeth hurt. Brain freeze. Too cold. It's better. Better? I have diabetes now, but it's better. Nope. Not better? Nope. I wish it was a little bit more bubbly, but then again, that's not my fault or the cocktail's fault. It's Noah's fault for pouring the Sprite lemon lime soda too early. Joke's on you. I don't care. It's all right. This by itself is terrible. Definitely needs a mixer. 
Do you have a bad impression of Bill Cosby? Because that's been happening today. I, I think everybody's got a bad impression of Bill Cosby. <laughs> jello, jello, oopity boopity boopity, jello. Okay, well, that was, that's a uh, new worst yeah, one. Yeah, that's a new worst uh, one. I mean, <laughs> it's in like. In fact, you know, I think by comparison, every other Bill Cosby impression is good. Right? Gelatinous pudding. Jello sweaters. <laughs> Rudy. Is that. <laughs> Alvin. <laughs> I, that's. I think that's right. Mmm, Theo, don't try the sweet tots vodka, cause it's got three olives inside. That is the least worst Bill Cosby impression of the day. Oh, you mean just that's put usually that anyway. Me. Yeah, I'm not doing great right well now. Well done, sir. All right, any last thoughts on the cocktail? Better or worse than the meat tarts? This vodka? is what you use to get 13 year olds drunk. Yes, that's what, I, I mean, that's what one would use. One could. One could, hypothetically speaking. One mm -hmm. might. One would not uh, condone Of such course not. ...behavior. Well, the consensus is that most people seem to like it in cocktail form. You were the rare exception. You preferred it room temperature and neat. Right. If possible, I would, you know, next time I would just shotgun this right out of the bottle. I mean, I don't know if shotgunning glass is a good idea, but I'm willing to find out. If I were to have this, what I would do is break the bottle over a uh, table and then stab myself in the neck. Tarts Vodka, definitely one of the best ones from Three Olives, and I would say one of the better ones overall that we've done on Why Would You Drink That? I don't know if I just have completely lost the will to have discerning taste buds, but I kind of like it. I don't think it needs a chaser. I think it tastes great neat. Might even warm it up for the holidays. You know, it's getting, it's getting cool out. I think we might need to have an intervention. Well, T, is this the only way I can watch you drink alcohol on the internet? No, actually. As a matter of fact, wow. the good people over at Cinefix have started a new movie drinking game show and they asked me to help them out with it. So if you want to go watch me drinking more, click my face. Just click it, be nice. Don't do other things to my face. Like that. That didn't work. I was hoping my head would explode, but it didn't work. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Noah Galutin. Subscribe to Taste It, and you can watch us give tea an intervention next week. If by intervention you mean more flavored alcohol, then I'm completely on board. We'll see what happens.